Hello everybody and welcome to the barbecue shop here at Hayes Garden World in the beautiful sunny Lake District. Today we're joined by Mr Richard Holden. Hello. And in this video we are doing something sweet. We're going to do dessert, we're going to do some simple crepes on the barbecue using one of the GBS griddles. So Richard, talk us through what we need to make these crepes. In our jug here we've got our batter which is just plain flour, a little bit of melted butter, some egg and uh, one egg and some milk and that's just been allowed to sit for a day just to allow, in the fridge, and it's just to allow all the flour to kind of make sure that it's fully incorporated and we don't get any lumps. Uh, we've got our butter here, we've got our GBS griddle in the wok and uh, nice and warm. Just going to take a little bit of butter, just a smidge. Yeah. You can never have enough butter. Not being shy. Make sure you've got a nice coating on the wok, on the, um, on the wok, on, on the, the griddle. Uh, griddle. And then once that's in, just give this a little swirl around, just so that it's nicely thinned out and it doesn't uh, cook on the outside before it cooks on the, in the middle lid down, we'll give that about 30-40 seconds, we'll flip that over, we'll have some nice colour on the base and then we'll just make sure that second side's cooked. Let's have a look at our first little crepe. There we go. Over oh, we go. Yes. Nice bit of colour. Sometimes it's just like pancakes on Shrove Tuesday. If the pan's too hot or too cold, the first one may not be quite right, but a quick adjustment on the dials and the second and third ones will be absolutely fine. So that one's, we're happy with that one, we'll leave that a little bit longer and then we'll, we'll carry on and make some more. So, a little quick amount of time on the second side, oh. just to uh, just to make sure that we've got everything cooked. Do you want me to bring this over? Yeah, Are let's bring that board over. So that's our first one. Quite happy with that one for a first attempt. And then a little bit more butter in, and uh, kind of rinse and repeat, really. So we'll cook some more off, and then we'll come back when we've got everything ready to go. That is the best one yet. So we've cooked a few off. Yeah, last, last one. one is just coming off. And as always with crepes or pancakes or whatever, they just, they, you, you get the temperature of the, the pan just right. So as always, the more you do, just like barbecue in general, the more you do, the more the temperature gets consistent and the better the, the results. So these pancakes, especially the last few, have been really, really consistent. So if you want to talk about where the recipe is, I'll kind of dress this and I'll get you to do a little bit of um, chocolate at the end. Okay then. So if you want to find more details about this recipe, visit our website, hayesgardenworld.co.uk. We're across all the social media platforms. If you want to see more videos like this one, visit our YouTube channel, Hayes Garden World. Also, if you like more information about the griddle, uh, the Genesis barbecues, or any of the accessories we use in these videos, visit the barbecue shop team here at Hayes Garden World and they know all about the accessories. So, can I be helping with anything? Yeah, if you um, just get ready with the... Oh, some chocolate. Where are we? Maple syrup. So we're gonna go in with some mix, just whatever mixed berries you have, and then we're just gonna drizzle over with some maple syrup. There we go. And then if you want to start with that, I'm just going to be very brave here. You can tell it's the last shoot of the day because the film crew are going to love this. But we're going to go in with a little bit of icing sugar as well. <laughs> All over the place. That was really worth it, wasn't it? So we'll do that and then we'll just pop in some nice fresh mint tips as well. Something simple. You could do that on a weekday evening. Something just a little bit of a... Uh, Nice little sweet treat for after you've had your barbecue. That looks pretty good. Okay then. So we're going to tuck into this and we'll see you next time. <laughs> 